Hello and welcome to this demo video. We're going to be playing the Three Hopes demo. So I haven't played a Warriors game in a very long time. So we're going to see what this has to offer. We're going to start out on hard mode. Um, I guess we'll do classic. I don't know how that translates. What is this? All right, take more time to examine strategic information. Uh, keep the action flowing. Turn off level up windows and mission briefs. Only important. All right, fuck it. <laughs> We're just gonna go for it, dude. We're just gonna. We're just gonna go for it. All right, sure. Let's let's just die then. If we make mistakes, that's fine. All right, so we're starting off with the Lost City, or the Forbidden Zone. That's all, like, techno, so that's that's good. I actually can't hear the game right now because I'm playing this through OBS. Well, it's just being streamed to OBS from my Switch. Now we got some people. I'm probably going to skip cinematics, to be honest. Um, yeah, so we're just going to skip some stuff. <laughs> we're just going to... We're going to dive into the gameplay. That's why I'm here. I'm here for the gameplay. All right, here we go. We got Getz. He looks like he's a green unit. <laughs> so I can only assume... I'll do female, Shez, and male, Byleth. For fun. And then we'll do it the opposite on the second playthrough. Okay, I cannot skip this. Unfortunate. Um, let's call her Per. Per pill. That's a reference to her hair. It is per pill. All right. What's your name? Per pill. Well, it looks like there's hope for you yet. Uh, apologize profusely. Uh, what? Dude, this is so anime right out of the gate. All right. I mean, this is a very anime game, so I can't really fault them for that. All right, choose the Ash and Demons form. All right, we'll make a male. Very edgy. Very edgy, very moody. Gyleth. Oh, dude, it transferred over! I just made a male Byleth and named him Gyleth. That's hilarious. I just made... I'm, I'm playing Three Houses right now as of, like, two days ago. And I just made a Gyleth. Yeah, that's it. It's Gyleth. <laughs> it's funny that they pulled that from my game. Alright, I still cannot skip this. Alright, we're gonna... We're just gonna rush through this. Wish him luck. Alright, cool. Alright, so from what I understand about these games, like, each unit has, like, a few basic combos, and you just have to, like, learn when to use certain things. Um. <laughs> Alright. Uh, okay. Alright. Advance on the destination. Alright, so far this is looking... Okay. Alright, we have, like, some attacks. Can I jump? Is there a jump in this game? It's like a dodge roll. I'm gonna be doing this a lot, I'm sure. Is there a sprint? Alright, we're doing like combos or something, that's cool. So this is my first playthrough, like obviously I'm gonna be learning a lot. And then I'm gonna be making tutorials on this after I know what I'm doing. So right now I'm just kinda... Dude, this is crazy how many guys I'm knocking around. Okay, it's telling me. Alright, so we can hit X to perform a class action lawsuit. That's cool. Charge the thing, sweep the thing, hold X, uh, blah 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 blah, during action, strong attack, just charge. Okay. Okay, strong action. Alright, so here's the class action lawsuit. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we can like dodge and stuff. Alright, this is, this is. This is a lot of dudes on the field though. Can I like, zoom out? I feel like this is like too. too close. I'd like to be more zoomed out. Alright, I guess that's it. Okay, cool. Alright, we're figuring it out in this game here. Let's get some movement. Let's get some horizontal movement. Lock on. 
Okay, push an R. Okay. To lock on to a boss, alright. It's got a dodge roll, so it's very Dark Souls in this way. Or Demon Souls, if you're OG. Because Dark Souls is basically just Demon Souls. Alright, so I have to defeat this guy. So we can kind of do one of these. Alright, oh, there we go, X. Aha! Look at me, I'm so fast! <laughs> I'm so fast! Press R to display quick menu, press X or Y. Cool. Okay, many R. Right? Oh no, it's ZR, my bad. That's cool. Alright, so let's kind of maneuver around him. Main mission successful. Okay, cool. Okay, okay, and I can see the thing in the corner there. Do I have to kill these? Advance on the path, alright. I will do that. We must advance the plot. So what if I just hit X? Okay, so that just okay, so so Y, X. Okay, so we can't combo back into Y. Oh, that's the end of the combo chain? Okay, alright, got it. And it seems I can like run like a maniac if I just hold an X. Which is kinda cool. Dang, that dude, that dude got messed up. Base captain. <laughs> I hope this game has like a harder than hard mode, or I hope that hard mode's very hard. Um, like, or, there, or there's like a nightmare mode or something. Uh, okay. Stronghold captain. Oh, yeah. Time to stun gauge will appear at enemy commander's head. Continue attacking to completely deplete, deplete the gauge. Form a critical rush. Alright, cool. <laughs> All right. Go, go, go. Okay. Okay, so X, cool. Critical rush, yeah. <laughs> Critical rush, mission successful. Oh yeah, victory lap. All right. Okay, we got a bunch of people appearing, kind of all over the place. So I guess we'll just go fight some of these guys. Probably don't need to be so hesitant. So these seem like they die pretty easily. Main mission start: defeat his main forces. Guyleth, the Ashen Demon, not Guyleth. Zelda and the evil forces of Link. Okay, so so far this is fun. I'm just trying to like mess around with different combos. So you kind of just run through the basic enemies. Good to know. Okay, and then you can kind of link things together. Neat. Purple. <laughs> Such a dumb name. All right, press A. Dude, there's like so many things. <laughs> there's so many different things. All right, we'll kill this mercenary captain, I guess. With a Zelda move. Oh no, we're getting attacked. Perfect dodge. 
I mean, I guess. I just was dodging. I wouldn't say it was perfect. <laughs> I wouldn't call it a perfect dodge. I would just call it a dodge. X attack. Yeah! Super X D6. 40 double slash. Let's go get him, man. Alright. Guess I can't go this way because there's a gate. Cool. Uh, how do we zoom out? Alright, whatever. We gotta go this way to fight the Ashen Demon. <laughs> the run animation's hilarious, dude. It's just, like, so wild. Uh... Alright, here we go. The moment of truth. Alright, let's check this out. Oh shit, I didn't know we are gonna be doing these. I didn't know it was gonna be like that. Guileth. Stand down or die. We're gonna fight the Avengers the Captain. He's doing what I'm doing. He's just running around really fast. Yeah. Hut, hut. Yeah. Zelda. <laughs> <He's> just... <laughs> Am I breaking the AI in the first, like, ten minutes of gameplay? Come on, dude. What is this? What is this nonsense? Defeat Guiling and Avenge. Defeat Guileth and Avenge. <laughs> We're just running in circles. No, he hit me. No. I'll, pr I'll try practicing dodging. Center, you're supposed to lose this. Get has died. Oh no, not purple. All right, we lost. Oh, he's so powerful. Look at his haircut. <laughs> his haircut is too powerful. He's cutting right through our defenses. <laughs> Did he just punch her in the face? <laughs> it's very... Oh! Oh no. My sword. My baby iron sword. No. I don't even know what's going on right now. Probably because I skipped the cutscene, to be fair. <laughs> Just keep skipping everything. This is the spoiler. Oh, am I supposed to win this one? Alright, Hollyhands. Defeat Guyleth using uh, Mitch magic attacks. Alright, All right, let me get used to this camera stuff. Alright, we're... <laughs> I'm trying to... There we go. Alright, I'm not really... Oh no, they're... To protect him. Galeth temporarily fell back to assess the situation. Elite soldier. Alright, let's lock on. That, that seems like a good idea. So far the mechanics are good. I like them. Alright, we did a special. Cool. We showed him who's boss. Geralt's mercenaries. I guess we'll do this amazing ability that just kills everything. I hope there's, like, a real, like, skill ceiling to the game. I, I'm assuming there is because of the way the mechanics are. So I'm, I'm, I'm both assuming and also hoping. All right, here's Guyleth. Guyleth has is done assessing the situation. Gerald, that's enough. Hey, Gerald's alive? He's not allowed to be alive. It's good. Um, we're going to do an ability. All right, I guess we lose anyways. Sorry, but this fight is, Sorry, but this fight is over. <laughs> Why is he apologizing? Why? We've achieved our goal. You didn't. You failed to stop us. You failed to stop us so bad we're leaving. Grr. Another time, perhaps. We're not done here, girl. Oh, no! <laughs> She's like, falls over. No, no, Purpel is... <laughs> Purpel has fallen. We must keep her alive at all costs. Purple. Propel. Oh, where am I? You're in the nether realm. I'm Cornelius. <laughs> I'm Cornelius. I know your voice. I dreamed about you. 
I'm solid white. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Good to know. Uh, all right, we're skipping this. Sorry, guys. If you're if you're here, you you if you know anything about me and my channel, I don't show story stuff and I don't emphasize story. I'm just all about gameplay. So and also like you should probably like run through the story yourself if you want to play it and stuff. This is just like a fun video. This is just like diving into this game via skipping things like a madman. Drinking water, skipping stuff, sk skipping cutscenes. I'm going to call him Anvil. <laughs> For no particular reason. Somehow this game loads faster, or seemingly faster than... Um... <laughs> seemingly faster than uh, three, three Houses, even though... From what I can tell, there's more going on, so it's kind of crazy that it loads faster. Oh, wait, this is, what is uh, this? Oh, that's neat. Uh, I'm a flugel? <laughs> what? <laughs> can I not be? <laughs> Dude, right, I'm not. Gonna, I'm not gonna be able to like. I'm, I'm gonna have to go through these things and actually read what it's saying. But as far as I can tell right now, we can just kind of button mash. I mean, I'm. I'm not. I don't know, dude. We'll see. Hopefully hard mode requires, like, actual game knowledge and stuff like that. Otherwise, we're gonna be- we're gonna have a hell of a time. I'll still cover, like, the units and everything. Mmm! They brought back my dude. I used him in a thumbnail recently. This guy. He looks like such an idiot, but he's awesome. He's like the alpha, like, dumbass. <laughs> he's like, if an alpha male were a dumbass, he is that. He's also got some serious forehead game. Holy shit. Alright, we have a new ability, I guess, that's completely insane. This is... Alright, he, he's... Seeming... Oh, dude, <laughs> stop popping shit up in the middle of combat. I don't... Just, like, put that on loading screens. Why is it... It's like, by the way, do this thing. Oh, wait, what the hell? I'm get, what? What is happening? <laughs> I want to control Edelgard. I want to be purple. Alright, I guess, I guess we're Bagelgard now. All right, we'll try one of her abilities. Cool. So it seems like you would just basically be swinging, like, like you know, learning your normal attacks, your combo chains, and then um, your class abilities, stuff like this. Comboing it in with your weapon skills. It looks like they have a cooldown. Uh, I don't know how durability factors in, if it does at all. It seems like it's it might be factoring in in terms of, like, a resource that just recharges or something. We'll see. These, dude, these run animations are crazy. Like, I feel like I'm, like, an insane person who's, like, on... Like, it's so fast. It's so nuts. It's just it's just so crazy. <laughs> it's not bad. It's just kind of jarring. Uh, okay. Change orders. Dimitri is a soldier with a strong advantage against sword wheel. Oh, they have the weapon triangle in this? Okay, that's interesting. Switch to Dimitri. Hey guys, I'm here. I'm here to help. It's time to kill it. Hey guys, it's time to kill every last one of them. <laughs> it's like, good guy Dimitri. <laughs> it's time to kill every last one of them. Alright, let's do this Earth Splitter. It's pretty cool. One of the thieves remains. Oh shit, they got Wyvern Lords, dude? Hell yeah. Yeah, I have a feeling I'll like this game. There's so much, there's so much. If I was, to, if I were to design a game like this, I would start off, here's how you do this thing. And then like 10 minutes later, here's how you do this thing. And like, like slowly, layer things in. This game is just like, here's 10 billion mechanics. <laughs> like, right away. Here you go. Not that it's, like, overwhelming, because obviously, like, if I play this game for, like, a couple hundred hours and do tutorials for it, I'll know all of this, but it's just, like, laying it on, like, super quick. Uh, but I did I did do this, the quick thing, the quick option, so I guess that's partially my fault, if not completely my fault. Uh, but it's just, it's just a lot of information at once. Um, I think it should be a little bit more gradual. That's all. It's it's not so much the speed of the information, 
in terms of when it pops up it's just like how it's like every every other battle there's like some new pop-up where i'm supposed to stop gameplay and read something and this is like a thing for like teaching players how to play your game instead of teaching me it's just kind of like telling me it's like do this thing it's like all right <laughs> i guess i will issuing orders okay this is all right <laughs> this is getting <laughs> All right, you here. Yes. Claude doesn't have the greatest advantage against that enemy. Oh, okay, so we wanna. All right, cool. All right, and then you. I guess wanna go here. Oh no, that's like a counter. Uh, whatever, fight this. I guess. She doesn't. Okay, I guess it wants me to weapon triangle. Uh, these dudes, uh, and then you, I guess I have to, I can't, can't order shez. Alright, so here you go. Alright, use purple to color the enemies purple. Alright. Alright, so Dimitri's low on health, which I'm not a fan of. Alright, it's hard to, like, do I need to enable health bars or something? I have no idea how much health these dudes have. All right, take it down. The wisest thing to do would probably be to just like rush with these dudes, just like kill things with them. Holy shit! <laughs> He's a build, dude. This is crazy, and I understand what's going on. Like I'm dodging and I'm hitting and whatever, but it's still it's still a little wild. Dimitri has de defeated the thief. Good job. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'm just like running into the wall. Alright, let's kill this guy. Guess I'll use this. Hey, it's our boy! Knights of Zeros. Get back, bandits. I'm going to hit you with my axe. I will say one thing, though. Action games definitely are pretty hype. So, like, when I'm doing, like, even, like, a casual Let's Play, there's, like, kind of more to work off of. Alright, we're gonna kill this guy. Let's try... one of these... I guess we'll just keep continue. We'll just use the win more button. Right, I don't know where my dudes are. Okay, from orders. Um, order an all out attack. Okay, I've launched. Launched an all out offensive. Defeat Costas? Oh, the bandit? Okay. Press R plus A to awaken. Alright. Alright, so it's kind of like a get out of jail free card. Nice. I'm awakened. And you will be put to sleep. <laughs> Poor Costas. Is he dead? No, no. <laughs> Just like spamming buttons. Hooray! We did it. But what did it cost us? <laughs> it, co it cost us everything. Stop jumping around my face already. Sorry, dude, but this is a Warriors game. You're gonna be jumped all over. <laughs> His whole existence in all the Fire Emblem games is just to get, like, dunked on by everything. Alright, I defeated Costas. Is it over? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Um. Okay, 
I guess I got S rank. I mean, it's the first level, whatever. Cool. Purple. Level two. MVP. I mean, I would hope I'm the MVP. I don't know. I guess the AI can show me up. Level up. Cool. Gotta keep aiming higher. Gotta keep aiming higher. Defeat enemies gain experience. Sold up units. Proves their stats. Depends on their individual qualities. Uh, I, don't, I wonder if there's growth rates or if it's just like static. I, I would imagine there's growth rates. Combat arts and magic will level up after they've been used. Okay, good to know. This is fun. I can see myself playing this a lot. Yeah, I mean, I wanted to cover it, and so far it's pretty cool. I don't understand how the permadeath factors in. I guess I have to keep my units alive, so when I do, like, attacking certain enemies or whatever, or, I'm, or like, pushing objectives, I have to keep, I have to kind of babysit them a bit, or have them all, like, push together. Um, okay. Nice. That's rank. We got Srank. I mean, I don't really know how you could not... I mean, I'm sure the first level is easy. It's just, you know, easy S rank. Hang on, you're the Imperial Princess? And the hair to the... Her, her face. She, her eyes are like nuts. Yes. We are the three hopes. I am hope number one. I am hope number two. And I am hope number three. We are the three hopes. Boast loudly. Play it cool. No need. <laughs> no need for false humility. Dude, this the dialogue in this game versus Three Houses, like everything is like super dramatic. I mean even even this character, like Byleth Bylet female Byleth versus this character, this character's like way more out there in in certain ways. I like how Hey, he just loaded in. Hey guys, I loaded in. Who, me? Yeah, you idiot. Alright. <laughs> you dingus? Yeah, you dingus, we're gonna go attack some bandits. We're gonna go run around and go to the camp. Oh hey, it's all the it's all the people. It's all the guys. It's all the guys and all the girls. Oh, what the heck? They have their normal They have their normal hairstyles. What happened to the the crazy hair and all the trailers and shit? Hello, welcome to our base camp. I'm awesome. I'm going to teach you everything you need to know, whether you want to learn it or not. These three young people you assisted earlier are the head of the academy. Academy's three houses. Great. Can't skip it. All right. <laughs> All right, we're just going to spam through this. Spam, 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 spam. All right. Speak to the... Okay, so this is very much like the beginning. All right, let's check out these units. I heard all about you. Hey, aren't you the Merc that helped Claude and the others? She's gunning. <laughs> Rain on her parade. Dude, why is everything so black and white? So why would I be a dick to her? Like, what is that? <laughs> I'm just being an asshole. It's <laughs> like, ah, the famed mercenary. I wouldn't say I'm that famous. Ah, the famed mercenary. As the noble, press him for details. Oh, I thought it was someone else. Oh, okay. All right, thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh, excuse. <laughs> oh, it's Lysithia. Oh no, we got Marianne. We got the whole, the whole group. We got the bloom effect on the hair going on there. We got the bloom going on. Oh shit, it, dude, it's student. Oh, I remember this guy. We got Hilda. You're the mercenary. Appreciate what you did for us. Killing those 10,000 soldiers and all. Tell him you understand. I understand. <laughs> okay. I don't... I don't know. Do I have to learn about them? Alright, cool. Alright, so I'm going to assume this is like the other one where I can just learn about one of them. Because I'm, I'm going to go through this later. I'm not going to do this in a video. Oh, shit. It's Manuela. Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright. I'm having way too much fun with this. Okay. 
Ask why she wants to hire you. Why do you want to hire me? Well, you have purple hair, so I think you might be a pretty cool, uh, talented person. Tell me about Edel Edelgard. Oh boy. You do realize you're addressing the hair. I'm sorry, the heir to the Imperial Throne. Um, must be nice. Must okay. Right on. Got it. All right, you do realize you're addressing someone with purple hair, don't you? The nerve of this wench. Okay. What do we got going on here? We got Hanneman. Cool. Uh, we got who's that? Ash. We got Dimitri. We got to do. He's gonna to do it. We got one of. We got my actual favorite unit, Mercedes here, with her OG hair, hanging out with Annette. Standard, standard stuff. Say that you have. Say that you haven't. Most of them, yeah. You've got a real cast of characters here. Well, isn't someone a go-getter? We haven't even. <laughs> that was my Mercedes voice. We haven't even talked to everyone. Because <laughs> she always sounds like that. Show surprise. <laughs> Dude, what is this? This is These dialogue options are really getting to me. It's show surprise. Why don't you thank him for the advice? Alright, I guess I'll thank him for the advice. That seems like a more reasonable response than showing surprise, whatever the hell that means. Alright, he's a high lord. He gets very high, and he's a lord. Good to know. Alright, let's check out what Mercedes does. So she's a priest. Hey, she has love to serve, just like in the other game. Cool. Radiant love. Level one. Looks like Dawn's almost here. It looks like a radiant Dawn is almost here. You like that? I bet you do. That's a, <laughs> it's a terrible joke. It's not even really a joke, it's just a reference to another game. Alright, we're going to continue. Ah, oh, Purpil. Leaving already? Um, Alright. I guess I'll do a thing instead of not doing a thing. Oh uh, yes, I'm... I do like that they're, they're incorporating him more, because he's actually one of the funnier characters that they just kind of had pop in here and there in the game in three houses and I feel like he has like no character arc at all he's just kind of like a doofus so they could have done more with him and it's like a missed opportunity but I mean obviously they did so much of the dialogue and everything so what are you gonna do dude Anvil needs to chill out you know he's he's way too uh, off-putting <laughs> except that you have no choice all right <laughs> <laughs> I can't just accept or decline. It's like, accept that you have no choice. It's like so over the top. You have no choice. You must accept this. Alright, we're skipping this. Sometimes I forget. Things can be skipped. Alright, cool. Alright. Three houses. Prologue. Shouldn't be three hopes though, because isn't that the other game? All right, we're skipping this. Unfortunately, we're keeping this train moving. It's derailed a few times at this point, but <laughs> we're skipping everything. I'm not. I'm not gonna watch this two-minute cutscene. We don't have time for this. We have to get moving. Oh hell yeah, we got Yuritsa, ya boy, your boy, Yuritsa. Greetings. My name is Rhea. Yes, it is. <laughs> Show us some pride. Oh, I, I would never act like this character. You what? Can I change my character <laughs> to someone who isn't this person? <laughs> Turn her down. All right. Express interest in the offer. <laughs> the wording is just really throwing me off. Agreed. All right. Why give me the option if it's going to happen anyways? Or uh, maybe you can turn it down, I don't know. I believe you will go far based on this two, this one minute interaction. <laughs> don't take this as me shitting on the game, I'm just like... I'm just having fun with the dialogue. So far it's it seems like it's fun, so that's pretty fun. 
And I'm not one for storylines, unfortunately. Okay, so I can join any house I want. You simply have to name it. And if you forget the name, we will kill you on the spot. All right, so... So picking a house in this game is more of which units do I want to try out. Uh, I guess I'll go with Blue Lions first. Uh, Nod, your ascent? Dude. Who wrote that? That's, so, that's just so odd. Nod, your ascent. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Greet him. Admire his ability. Will you now? <laughs> what is happening already? Perhaps you should be in our student's new house. I don't care. You decide. Well, certainly you'll hear no objections from me. Alright. This is now a voice channel, apparently, where I do stupid voices. Uh, the gall of these people, making decisions for you. It's enough to make one's head spin. See, the big upside of Sothis is that she interacted with you infrequently. Which made her somewhat interesting as a character, because essentially she's like a goddess or whatever the hell. But she was present, but not overused. And I think the difference is very noticeable with this one dude constantly chiming in and giving us his like mental thoughts uh, like on things um we got a fighter a soldier a myrmidon a monk a fighter a monk she's a monk too oh yeah i guess that is like the base class these are like base classes all right right on we'll we'll flip them into their correct roles as soon as we can Hello, new students. I am purple hair. Yes, you are. Wait, why am I in the uniform? I thought I'm a professor. Dude, I love how smug Dimitri looks. He looks so smug for no reason. He's like, yes. You're being rude, Felix. Quite the exceptional fighter. I feel like this would be, like, Felix's girlfriend. Because she seems, like, edgy and kind of out there. If that makes sense. Like, that's like this character doesn't even really... Like, the, the playable character so far doesn't really f feel <laughs> like a character. It's more just, like, some, like, side character. And, like, that's what I think so far. Um, honestly, I'd rather play as Yuritsa. Because he's pretty interesting. Like, he's like the Death Knight and shit. Like, that's... That's kind of cool. It's that a... Dude, her eye is freaking me out. <laughs> her one massive eye. <laughs> it's just, like, too big. Like, it's way larger than everyone else's. And it's just kind of jarring at times. Like, look at how big her eye is. It's insane. Take the praise and run with it. Advise greater caution. Dirt nap before? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Express fire off a quip? Dude, what? Alright, I'm gonna. I, if they give me these options, I'll fire off a quip. I don't even know if that was a quip, though. Not that quips are, like, good. Alright. Oh, some mysterious things are going on. Hmm, I wonder what it could be. Hmm. There you are, Yuritsa. There you are. I have word from the knights. They are knights. Alright, we're skipping this. <laughs> they are knights. I have word from the knights. They are knights. The gatekeeper is pleased. <laughs> Dude, let me play as the gatekeeper. That's who I want to be. I kind of regret making the character the female one just because her cr her crazy eye is kind of freaking me out a bit. <laughs> it's, it's kind of off putting. Pathetic. Pathetic. Alright. A lot going on so far. 
Okay, victory conditions. Defeat the thieves. Defeat conditions. None. Alright, this is like practice battle, I guess. Uh, how do we... Do we choose who we run, or is it just forcing me to run these? Uh, let's go over to like this. Let's see what this is. Can I not do that? Toggle map zoom. ZL list. Deployed units. Okay, here we go. Okay, cool. Alright, change units. Uh, change deployment. Uh, <laughs> deployed units. Alright, whatever. I'll figure this out later. Auto battle? Uh, army status? System? Let's check out system. See what kind of settings we have. Um, okay. Sh sure. Sure. Encounter and death cutscenes. I shouldn't bring Uh, whatever. All right, we'll go for it. Sure. We're just diving in. That's what this video is. This is a dive in type of video. All right, we gotta get this thief. Assigning adjutants. Okay. Approach an allied unit and press L plus Y. I'd rather do this in advance of a thing instead of during. But all right. Uh. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> can I just kill them? <laughs> I'm kind of like getting into this mindset where it's like, can I just kill them? Because the type of game this is, I, I, I mean, I guess if they didn't have like strategic elements, it would be weird if it was just like straight up a Warriors game with no extra like Fire Emblem type stuff in it. But part of me loves simplicity. Like, I'm a huge, I'm a pretty big fan of chess, to be honest. And chess is, like, a very simple game, but it's, like, hard to master. So, sometimes complication, while it can be marketable and cool, and, you know, it can be hype as, hype as fuck, I think, I think less is more in a lot of cases. I think just a few good gameplay mechanics with a high skill ceiling are very timeless, and having, like, too many mechanics can kind of be a pitfall of game design. Like, the perfect example is, like, TF2, right? Like, that game hasn't died. It has a bot problem, sure. Uh, but the game hasn't died because its mechanics are so solid. But they're very simple. And also, there's a lot to them. So it's, like, you, it's up to you to kind of, like, min-max the mechanics. Uh, but we'll figure this game out anyways. I'm not saying that its complication's always bad or something. This is just like my first, this, this is literally like my first 40 minutes playing this game. Alright, mission successful. Dude, we defeated the gatekeeper! Oh my god! We're evil. We defeated a god. Alright, let's just like fight these guys. Just let me get locked onto this. I guess we kill that dude. It seems like we're just like killing things really fast, but it is like the first level, so to be expected. Oh, a chest. We need to find the key. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> he can get it open just like in the other game. That's funny. All right, I guess we wanna. <laughs> Zr. Okay. All right, open that shit, dude. I'm just like killing these dudes on the way over. I guess that's the type of game it is where you just like kill everything constantly. You're just like constantly killing things. Here, we'll kill this. We'll defeat the thief. Yeah, I got it. He might steal the treasure. Not on my watch, thief. Guess we'll do the super kill. Kill him with the super kill, yeah. <laughs> yeah! 
Wow, we did it. Give me that key. I got a new material. Oops. It's a little bit further away than I realized. It seems like positioning, at least so far, is kind of easy to do. You just kind of keep rolling in between moves. All right, we're finally starting to hit a little bit. All right, there we go. They're getting some counterattacks in. Dimitri, no, he didn't. I seized it, dude. I killed that boss. He can't take credit for my work. Dimitri's a liar. <laughs> he did not seize this. Ash sees the chapel. See, Ash actually did seize the chapel. I'll give him that. I will give him that. He actually did do the thing. Oh, there's a thief alive. <laughs> Yuritz is just like running around murking dudes. Alright. No, don't kill him, Tommy. Seize the thieves' base. Alright, what's going on over here? It's like an item or something. Some dudes over here, we got a stronghold captain, cool. Money! Alright. <laughs> it's lots, it's loads of money. Now where is the thieves base, I guess? Over here? Stronghold captain? Alright, I guess we'll do a lot offensive. Yeah! <laughs> All out of it. <laughs> Alright, I think this is the thieves base. Yeah, we got a base captain. Dang, dude. Try to dodge. Alright, here we go. <laughs> we have a base captain just sitting there doing nothing. Okay, there he goes. He's attacking. All right, we seized the thief's bait, the thieves' base. Right, I probably should help my dudes fight that thing. Whatever's going on over here. All right, looks like they grabbed this. Investigate the dungeon. All right, uh, I'll do it. You convinced me to do the thing. Jesus, dude, these abilities are ridiculous. <laughs> All right, we'll get used to this, I swear. Or maybe not, because I'm just like zooming around the map, killing things. What the heck? There's a prisoner down here. She's a student. That's vaguely ominous. Oh, he's like blocking. Dang, dude, these attacks are insane. What the hell? These attacks are insane. I defeated 500 enemies. Okay. Still improving. <laughs> Could you imagine, like, being an actual soldier and killing 500 enemies? <laughs> And your mindset is, oh, I'm just still improving. I've only just essentially done the impossible. I mean, obviously you just kill tons of enemies in this game. All right, cool. We rescued the student. Who was in a cell and chained up to the wall. Very suspicious, if you ask me. All right, what does this do? Heals me or something? Does this actually heal me? What is this? All right, dude, chill out. What are you doing? <laughs> Why did that happen? I don't even know. Um, we must take the girl. Escort uh, to safety. <laughs> her name is just question marks. All right, let's escort her. 
Use the guard order. Okay. Um. Alright, I guess I have to sign a guard? These dudes are all just, like, doing whatever. Um. <laughs> Alright, what am I doing here? <laughs> oh, I have defense! Alright, whatever. I guess that does it. They're after the girl! It's a girl! Oh, we got a mystery soldier. Mysteries afoot. <laughs> what the hell is happening? <laughs> Dude, this game is wild. Grounder, get grounded, you fool. Alright, I'm just like destroying things with crazy attacks. And it's pretty wild. We're <laughs> like tornadoing dudes. <laughs> okay, now we're just like. <laughs> Yuritsa's just coming over on a horse. Just randomly. Side mission. Don't let the thieves retreat. Dude, this is like. This is like sensory overload. <laughs> There's like so much. There's just like everything happening all, all the time. Money! This is advancing. Dude! I, def I defeated the mystery soldier. I'm aware. <laughs> I'm aware that I defeated him. <laughs> you don't have to tell me. <laughs> I saw him die. You don't have to tell me this. Alright, she stopped advancing. Alright, we got another mystery soldier. Alright, ZR. What is it? ZR what? Oh, we just do it? Okay. Is it ZR, ZRR or something? I don't remember. I'll have to look that up or whatever. Alright, we gotta mysteriously use abilities. <laughs> He's just like bouncing. <laughs> it's hilarious. Grounder, get on the ground! Stop bouncing. Get back on the ground, you idiot. What are you doing? Kill the mages! Oh! They're <laughs> just like flying in the air. Oh, this is awesome, dude. This is sick. Get the money, quick! Oh no, it's a crystal! Cool, purple crystal! Awesome! Don't let the thief retreat! It's like, alright, jeez, dude. I'm trying over here. Are we protected? Question mark. Oh, where's the thief at? Oh, he's he's trying to retreat. We can't let that happen. No, he's gonna retreat. We can't let him retreat. No, he retreat. Oh my God, it's the thing. It's the lady, Kranya, huh? You can just call me the lady. That's about to murder you. All right. Got it. Uh, I'll deal with you later, Kranya. I have to deal with this thief first. Defeat Kranya. Dude, I don't have time for that. We have to defeat the thief. It's way more important. <laughs> it's just like some <laughs> generic soldier. It's trying to steal, like, some item or something. Alright. Alright, we'll go, we'll go handle Kranya now. You got a new material. Good, that's the last of them. Alright, question mark. Okay. Huh? Wait. Wait, what? She's real? So Kranya is an actual... They're different people now? Alright. I'm just like spamming abilities right now. Get grounded! Yeah! Get on the ground, Kranya! <laughs> Come on, Kroni, you can do better than that. Alright. I'm attacking these barrels over here. Release the creature we captured. She's very angry about that. Hey, a wild beast appeared. That's like the noise they make. They always go like, rah. Alright. It's some sort of beast. We have to take it. That's kind of cool. It's got like armor and shit. Alright, let's go beast. Let's 
to use. Oh wait, we have the beast attacks. I get it. I got it. I understand. All right, cool. Uh, wrath, wrath Strike, Grounder. I guess we'll use Wrath Strike. Use our crazy, crazy ability. I'm here to aid you. Do we move away from this? I feel like we might. Oh, he healed himself. All right, cool. Grounder. Come on, dude. I played Guild Wars 2. I know about dodging things. <laughs> Come on, bruh. Bruh. There's <laughs> all these fighters. All right, let's not go to the front of it. That's it. There we go. I also played a little bit of Monster Hunter, but not a ton. Crazy special move. Awesome. Go. All right. <laughs> they defeated a demonic beast? Impossible. You'll all pay. Alright. Cron, you're treated. Report! <laughs> this is like so wild, dude. This is getting nutty. This is getting very nutty. I'm definitely buying this game, obviously. Oh, dude! <laughs> dude, the game said I'm an ass. What the hell? <laughs> The game just called me an ass. <laughs> That's rude. Gotta keep, aiming higher. Gotta keep aiming higher. I can't believe the game just insulted me. That's so trippy. I wouldn't expect that. Dude, look at that. Come on. Damage tick. Completed time A. Call me an ass. I won't let myself stop, I won't let myself stop here. All right, so she's a flugel. I don't know what that is. She learned Carpe Diem. Oh, game. <laughs> Come on. Carpe Diem, learned backbone. All right, we got some items. Um, okay, got it. Got it. Cool. Neat. Alright. Alright, I think that's a good time to stop. It's been almost an hour, so... So far, it's pretty fun. I mean, I'm assuming it's going to get much harder. Because it's like the first couple levels, so even on hard mode, it'll still be relatively easy. Uh, I'm also hoping that hard mode does get much harder. Um, yeah, <laughs> I'm really... I'm praying that it does. <laughs> Because so far, it's like I'm getting like A and S ranks, and I'm just assuming these are tutorial levels. Uh, but yeah, that's it for this one. Definitely like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. I also have Triangle Strategy content and some Three Houses content. I'm doing a Three Houses playthrough right now. Uh, but yeah, definitely subscribe if you want to watch more content like this. I'm also going to be doing guides for this game when it actually ships, after I put at least like 50 plus hours into the game. So that I actually know what I'm talking about. <laughs> instead of just like being overwhelmed with pop-ups. Um, but yeah. Thanks for watching and peace.